Go eat some bacon, but then feel kind of sad about it, because I've got 11 questions for you on farm animals. This is Trivia with Buds. All right, farm animals number one. Let's see if you know these. Here is the first one. Golly and Gussie are characters in Charlotte's Web that are what type of animals? Number one, Golly and Gussie are characters in Charlotte's Web that are what type of animals? Number one. Question number two, what is the typical lifespan of a goat? Is it five years, 10 years, or 15 years? Number two, what is the typical lifespan of a goat? Five, 10, or 15 years? Question number three, Cobb, Penn, and Signet are all male, female, and young names for what animal? Number three, Cobb, Penn, and Signet are all male, female, and young names for what animal? Question number four, what year did the movie Babe come out? Number four, what year did the movie Babe get released in theaters? Number four. Question number five, Lil Sebastian is a miniature pony found on what sitcom? Number five, Lil Sebastian is a miniature pony found on what sitcom? Number five. Question number six, Saddleback, Oxford Sandy, and Manga Litza are all types of what animal? Number six, Saddleback, Oxford Sandy, and Manga Litza are all types of what animal? Number six. Number seven, what is the name for a baby goat? What is the name for a baby goat? Number seven. Question number eight, what did the fourth little piggy have in the famous nursery rhyme? Number eight, what did the fourth little piggy have in the famous nursery rhyme? Question number nine, Russell Simmons started what brand in 1992? Number nine, Russell Simmons started what brand in 1992? And question number 10, who wrote the book Animal Farm? Number 10, who wrote the book Animal Farm? Your two-point bonus question is an acronym. For two points, solve the farm-inspired phrase with the acronym S-Y-W-O. What is a farm-related phrase uh, that fits the acronym S-Y-W-O? Those are all your questions for today's quiz on farm animals. We'll be right back in just a second with a wheelbarrow full of answers. We're back with the answers to farm animal trivia. Let's see how you did on this short quiz about the barnyard. Number one, Golly and Gussie are characters in Charlotte's Web that are what type of animals? They are geese. Golly and Gussie are geese. That makes sense. They all start with G. Number two, the lifespan of a goat is about how long? Is it five years, 10 years, or 15 years? It is 15 years. 15 years. Number three, Cobb, Penn, and Signet are all male, female, and young names for a swan. Number three, a swan. My sixth grade English teacher was named Mrs. Swan, and she was married to a guy who was a uh, medieval times performer, and he was missing a lot of fingers on one hand, and he would come into our class and teach us how to make chain mail. I don't know why that just popped into my head other than the name Swan, but I thought I would share it with you. Number four, what year did Babe come out? 1995. 1995, not uh, too long before when I was in that sixth grade class with Miss Swan. Number five, Lil Sebastian is a miniature pony found on what sitcom? Parks and Rec. Parks and Recreation. Number six, Saddleback, Oxford Sandy, and Mangalitsa are all types of pigs. Number six, piggies. Number seven, what is the name for a baby goat that is a kid? A kid. And number eight, what did the fourth little piggy have in the famous nursery rhyme? He had none. He had none. Number nine, Russell Simmons started what brand in 1992? Fat Farm, P-H-A-T Farm. 
And number 10, who wrote the book Animal Farm? One of my favorite books. I liked it because it was short and it had uh, very interesting characters and communism. Number 10, George Orwell was the answer there. George Orwell. And for two points, solve the farm inspired phrase with the acronym S Y W O. Sow your wild oats to go out and sow your wild oats. That was the acronym in question. Guys, that is today's quiz. I hope you had fun playing along on the podcast. If you know somebody that would love this show while they're on lockdown, send them some links of your favorite episodes and topics and help get the word out about trivia with buds. We have one more question for you. It's called the question of the day. And that question of the day is who wrote the book Ender's Game? Tweet me your answer at RyanBuds or email RyanBuds at gmail.com to be eligible for a prize. Yesterday's question of the day answer was smoke for the uh, portion of fog and uh, well, smoke and fog makes smog. That's what I was trying to say. And your trivia team name of the day is Cinnamon Toast Lunch. I've had it for lunch before, breakfast and dinner, maybe all on the same day. Cinnamon Toast Lunch. That is it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for your support over on Patreon. Go to patreon.com slash trivia with buds if you have a buck to spare to get some cool rewards in the mail. I'm getting ready to send out everything for March. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend, and we'll see you tomorrow for more trivia with me. Cheers. 